I'm Rob Gravelin, member of Culinary Team Canada, and this is my five-year-old son, Bo, who's going to assist me today in making some healthy Canadian Atlantic cod tacos. So what we're first going to do is we're going to uh, bread, our, bread our Atlantic cod, and Bo's going to help me out. So he's going to grab his cod, and he's going to dredge it in our seasoned flour. And the reason why we're dredging in our flour is so that the egg will stick to the fish. All right, very good job, Bo. Now let's put it in the egg white, or into the whole egg, sorry. Yeah, then we're gonna mix it in the egg. Make sure it's very, really well coated and you wanna take your excess egg and take it off. And then we're gonna dip it into our panko and almond crust. Ready. We're going to bake this in the oven on convection at 350 degrees for approximately five to seven minutes. So next what we're going to do is we're going to make the slaw to go with our tacos. So here we have some uh, honey crisp apples that Bo's going to put in the bowl for us. Honey crisp are my favorite. He loves honey crisp apples. They're also in season at this time of year. Perfect. Now we have some julienne carrot. Awesome. Next we're going to put in some uh, chiffonade Brussels sprouts. They're also in season this time of year. I like yep, put in one of his favorites, of course. And then we have some cilantro. What we're going to do is we're just going to pick the leaves. We're just going to pick the leaves off the stem here. Would you like to do that, Bo? There we go. Something we can do together. Okay, so now while Bo finishes that, we're going to squeeze the equivalent of half a lime into our salsa, or sorry, our uh, vegetable slaw. Next we have a couple pinches of kosher salt. We'll do one pinch, but we'll do the second. And then we have some freshly, then we have some freshly cracked pepper. Would you like to do one? There you are. In the whole way. There you go. Perfect. Awesome. Good job. Give it a little tap on top. There we go. So next Bo is going to pull up his sleeves and he's going to mix the slaw for us. As Bo is mixing the slaw, I'm going to get uh, prepared for our avocado aioli. So I have here is I have approximately half a cup of uh, aioli that was pre-made. If uh, you don't want to make aioli, you can substitute for Hellman's meal. How's that looking? Good. Let's see. Sure can. Let's have a little taste. Mm. Like this? Mm. Yum, that's a good uh, good vegetable slaw. Okay, so next what we're gonna do is we're just gonna give a little wipe to the counter here. That's fun. That's fun, eh? I always love cooking with mommy and daddy, eh? No, I just can't. I just keep my sleeves off if I need to do a nightmare or something. Okay, so next I'm going to squeeze two. Can I do one? You sure can. I'm going to squeeze two avocados into a bowl. Try not to get the. There we 
go. Just give your hands a good wipe. And what Bo's gonna do now is he's gonna grab the whisk and he's gonna just mash it. He's just gonna keep mashing like that until the, until the, um, until the avocado is nicely mashed up. Next so we're gonna add one quarter of a lemon or a lime juice. Lime juice. Always gonna put a pinch of salt in there. Come on, bud. A pinch of salt. There we go. Don't worry about the avocado on the whisk. And then we're gonna do some freshly cracked pepper. Next, we are going to add our aioli to our mashed up avocado. We're going to add approximately half a, half a teaspoon of smoked paprika for a little smokiness in the dish. Mm -hmm. And then we're also going to add uh, half a teaspoon of cumin. Okay, get it all in there. You want to give it a mix with your whisk bowl. Give it a nice good mix. So now we're going to grab our warm tortilla shells. I like to use the 50-50. Uh, so 50 corn flour, 50% regular flour. So first thing what we're going to do is we're going to Grab a good amount of the avocado aioli, spread it across here at the bottom. And Bo is going to do a second one. He's going to do this one. Our cod should be ready now to pull out of the oven. Nice, beautiful pieces of cod here. Just going to put these on the side here. All right, so we're gonna grab a good amount of our slaw here that we made. Okay. We're gonna put it right down the middle here. And then Bo is gonna do his own. Yeah, that one here. Yeah, you love working in the kitchen for me and daddy, eh? Yeah. Oh. oh, just a little bit, bud. I just wanna... No, that's enough. No, I'm gonna grab one out. More apple, okay. That's going to be a pretty big taco. So we're going to take our fish, put our uh, almond crusted fish, big okay, fish, cod on here. Bo's going to put his own fish on there. How do you even do it? Do you do it again? Yes. All right. And now we're going to fold up our taco yep. here. Do you want some help? Oh, I don't know if your taco's going to close. That's a lot of stuff in there. All right. I want it. So we're going to eat it at the same time. <laughs> yep. Here you go. You're going to have to eat that right over the cutting board because it's going to be messy. That's so much fun. All right, bud. Let's have a taste. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. Very nice and crispy, eh? Mmm. What do you think? Okay. Mm -hmm.